Hi guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today I want to tell you how I did DIY bug charm for Louis Vuitton. So here is my gorgeous trio, three of my purses and all those luggage tags that I did. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous. So let me know guys below what you think. Do you like this idea? Do you think it's practical or maybe it's a silly idea? I just want to know your opinion. Lately, bag charts from Louis Vuitton are getting extremely expensive. Before they were ex expensive, they were like between $300 and $500. But lately, when I went to um, uh, Louis Vuitton, I actually returned one of my bag charms. Once again, extremely expensive. There was a few bag charms, which is over $1,000 in Canadian crazy crazy price it's almost price of the bag right now so today i want to show you how i did my diy louis vuitton bag charm but before that i just want to share with you my makeup i don't think it's so much up front because today is extremely rainy weather outside and when weather is so rainy i really like to cheer myself up with um, nice makeup i hope i did a good job and i use natasha denona palette and uh, Kat Van D um, uh, lipstick. But anyway, let's go back to the bag charms. And I'm gonna show you three of my bags, three of my Speedy, and these bag charms specifically for Speedy. Um, so if, obviously, Speedy comes with um, a, a lock, and if you have a luggage tag, that's what you can do. This is bag number one. This is my bag number two. It's my one of my recent purchases. It's a uh, World Tour Speedy. I didn't do review yet. So bag number two. And obviously here is my third print. It's in Damia Bean. So, and that's how all these bag charms look like. I hope if I can get uh, a better visual for you guys. So this is the variety of the bag charms. So I'm gonna keep these two bags as an example. I was actually using my um, Azure yesterday. It was a gorgeous weather. And uh, today is rainy, as I already mentioned. So obviously I have to change from my Azure, just like, you know, protecting the shatter. So I'm gonna give you an example on this one. So I'm gonna take the bag, a charm of the bag right now, and I'm gonna get closer to the camera and explain um, what uh, I did. So I have just a regular luggage tag. And you know, when you have just a regular luggage tag, usually it's um, fairly light. So even when you strap it to your um, um, bag it's kind of doesn't have enough weight and it's almost like a flapping you know in the wind sometimes it's turning over so in my bag charms i usually do my initials ol and on the other side i usually put stamp of canada i think it's very very pretty so here's the look that comes by default with the louis vuitton uh, speedy so what i'm doing right now i'm putting this lock through the loop on the luggage tag. I have to little bit wiggle so it's gonna get more centered and right away you can see it gives substantial weight to the luggage tag. So then through that little metal part of the luggage tag I kind of more secure the lock. So I just make sure that I pull it hard enough. So I just make sure that uh, it's secured and it's not moving. So there you go. So now lock securely uh, tied up to um, luggage tag. And you can see it's right away it has substantial weight. It has right away substantial weight. So on the back, you still can see Canada and obviously in your case you can put either your initial or maybe Hawaii or whatever you want and at the front there is a gorgeous LV right there 
and it has substantial weight so now i'm gonna strap this uh, luggage tag to my uh, bag so here is my gorgeous trio three of my purses and all those luggage tags that i did i think it looks absolutely gorgeous so let me know guys below what you think do you like this idea do you think it's practical or maybe it's silly idea i just want to know your opinion so guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you find it useful let me know if you like this idea once again you can see there is a significant weight so once again that's how it looks like on dummy bean and i have a bandolier in size 25 that's how it looks like on Azure. Once again, I have on size 25 and uh, bandolier. Once again, that's the tag right there. And last but not least, and that's how it looks like on my Speedy 30 bandolier. And it's a World Tour Speedy. And that's how the, the back charm looks like on Speedy 30. Thank you so much for watching. Leave your comments below. Don't forget to like this video if you like my idea. And obviously don't forget to subscribe. I hope to see you again on my channel and all the best to you. Bye bye.